Welcome back to the channel. So first of all, just log in with your credentials and once you're done with this, just simply come back over here, click on this checkbox and then click on this agree and continue. Now just wait and now just simply search for the Vertex AI. Just simply click over here, wait for a couple of seconds and then click on this workbench. Now just wait. And then click on this open Jupyter lab. Now it will take a couple of seconds to so just launch a Jupyter notebook. So just wait for that. And it's done. Now just simply click on this generative AI folder, then click on this language folder. Now let me just adjust this. And as you can see, these two files. So first of all, just simply click on this intro prompt file, double click over here. Now, if you're using a Windows machine, so just simply press Ctrl A. And if you're using a Mac, so just simply press Command A like this. And as you can see, it's converted into sky blue color. Now what you have to do, click on this run option and then click on this run selected cell. Now if you just simply come back over here and if you just hover over here, you can see kernel status. As you can see, status is busy. So just wait for a couple of seconds, and once the status is ideal, we can move forward with the next task. And as you can see, status is ideal. Now, what you have to do, double click on this file, intro plum file, like this. Now again, just simply do the same thing like this, then click on this run option, then click on this run selected cell. Now if you just hover over here and just check for the status. And as you can see, status is ideal. Now, if you just simply come, and come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for all the tasks, you will get a score without any issue. Just wait and watch. And if you are not able to get a score, no need to worry. Just wait for a couple of minutes and you will get a score without any issue. Now, just simply come back over here. Just simply click over here on this task, check my progress. As you can see, we got 70 out of 100. Just wait and we will get 100 out of 100 as well. And as you can see, we got a green tick for all the tasks. Now just simply come back over here. Let's check the score for this task as well. And as you can see, we got a 100 out of 100. And that's the way we have to complete this lab. If you still have any doubts, please do let me in the comment section. Thanks for watching and have a good day guys.